In this video, we're going to talk about uh, Rolle's theorem, but we're going to use the function that I'll just tell you flat out fails. And so well, let's take a look at why it fails, not simply that it does, but why it does. Okay, again, in Rolle's theorem, first of all, the question being asked to determine whether or not Rolle's theorem can be applied, we have to know what Rolle's theorem says. And so if f is continuous on some closed interval a, b, and if f is di uh, differentiable on the open interval a, b, and if the two y values at a and b are the same, then somewhere in between a and b, there must be some value where the derivative equals zero. Okay, so let's take a look at this. The first thing is, is f continuous on a, b? And now if you're like me and you don't really remember your trig functions that well, uh, I tend to remember sines and cosines and let it be at that. Well, tangent x is the same as sine x over cosine x. And right now, this is continuous as long as, so let's make a little note over here. This is continuous as long as, because sine and cosine are continuous, as long as the cosine of x is not equal to zero. Okay, well, cosine of x equals zero, where x is equal to pi over two. All right, so we have a problem at pi over two. So not continuous at pi over two. The question is, does our interval include pi over two? So is pi over two an element of zero to pi? Yes, it is. And so it fails in this first one. So our first question is, one, is tangent x continuous on zero pi? And the answer is no, it is not because it is not continuous at pi over 2. And if you recall the, um, the graph of tangent, at pi over 2, and this is another way to do it. You can just shove it in your calculator and take a look at it that way. But at pi over 2, this is pi over 2. Uh, this, of course, is 0, and this is negative pi over 2. Tangent comes up like this from negative infinity, crosses over at 0, and comes up and goes to infinity as it approaches pi over 2. Okay, and so we, we have a distinct problem there. So it is not continuous on the interval from 0 to pi. We have issues. And then it just kind of wanders off and does the same thing and repeats at 3 pi over 2. Pi over 2. Okay, so Wash, rinse, repeat. Unfortunately, uh, you start taking a look at this question one, it fails. So now we can just, we can just answer this as determine whether or not Rolle's theorem can be applied. No, the end, <laughs> it, it, it can't, it fails continuity. It also fails differentiability. Uh, we had a theorem before that said, if it's differentiable, then it's continuous. The converse, or the, the contrapositive of that, if it, if it is not continuous, it is not differentiable, okay? And that's true. It is not continuous, therefore, by that theorem, it is not differentiable. The end. So I hope, I hope that kind of, along with the other two problems that I submitted, I hope that kind of clears up Rolle's theorem. Uh, and, and you want to keep in mind the steps to go through. Check the conditions first. That's it, just step one, check the conditions to the end. Don't try to apply the theorem before you found out if the theorem can be applied or not.